Hi everyone, so today's video is going to be a haul video because I recently made an order on ASOS and it arrived, clearly. And I also went to Savers the other day and for those of you who don't know, Savers is an op shop and I thought I may as well put in what I got from Savers into this haul. So I hope you enjoy. Starting out with what I got from ASOS, the first thing is actually an item I'm wearing right now which you can't really see but it's this leather look pinafore dress that I have on right here. It uh, looks kind of like an apron from the front actually. Um, but yeah, it's this leather look, not real leather, it's pleather. It's from the Petite range in ASOS. Um, it has these po it has pockets at the front. It's quite a shiny leather look, so it's not like it looks the highest quality, but I quite like it. It's a bit of a daring piece, I suppose. You know, it's not an everyday essential. But I like it. I think it's something different. It's something cool. Uh, looks nice with basic sort of tops underneath, like this long one I have here. I think it's just a bit of fun. Next thing I have to show you is this skirt, and it is this tan... Uh, coloured skirt which is a sort of felt material and I just really like the detailing it has on the pockets with this uh, pleather trim I'm liking pleather at the moment and it's this, this really pretty mini skirt it has a zip up at the back I thought this is a really nice transitional piece into more of the autumn time with a pair of tights and boots that would look really nice the next thing I have to show you is this singlet top here which has this striped pattern on it with block white stripes and then the other stripes are um, sort of a tie-dye slash cloudy sort of pattern on them with sort of grey and black. And I also really like the detailing at the back which has this um, bar sort of strap along the back of it and it's a very low back. It's a simple piece but I think, think it can be styled to make a really nice outfit. Then the last thing I bought from ASOS is going to be great for winter time and it's this coat. Uh, it's rather big but I really like the length of it and the way that it sits on me. It um, is this, it's black obviously which I think is a good basic colour for a coat because it's going to go with the majority if not all of your wardrobe. Um, I've just rolled up the sleeves once. They're not too long, but they're a little long so that it doesn't look like it's swamping me. And then it has this sort of buckle up along the sleeves and buttons all down the middle. A great detail about it is the lining on the inside, which is this plaid pattern, which I think is just a really nice touch. It has a nice big collar, which I can flip up to look badass. And then another extra detail which I really like is along the shoulders and um, it's this pleather panelling which also goes all the way around to the back. Can you sense a trend here? A theme? I'm liking pleather at the moment. I think it's just a really nice detail. Now onto what I picked up from Savers. I actually ended up going on a 50% off day which I didn't know was going to be a 50% off day which was a bonus but also I went late after school so the place was pretty picked over and I only found one clothing item which was towards the end and I found it in the kids section and this is it here it is a denim mini skirt and I've wanted one for a while I think this like I've been looking at denim like skirts online but also when I go into savers I always look for them because I'm you know, feeling a sort of like mid-2000s vibe, style inspiration being Perry from Blue Water High. Anyone know what I'm talking about? It's originally by the brand called Junk, which a sassy name. Staple piece looks nice with a plain white t-shirt over the top. I'm digging it. And the next two things I have to show you are both pairs of shoes. And this is the first one. Yeah. Uh... Not everyone's cup of tea whatsoever. I think they're brilliant. Um, so basically on the front of them they look like bowling shoes sort of or forward slash converse but mostly bowling shoes and then they're actually wedges and they're a bit beat up but I, I think I like that about them and I just think they're freaking awesome. They're hilarious and they're cool. I went to school the other day and like 
I walked in them fine. And then the final item I have to show you, again, is a pair of shoes. Not quite as extreme as the ones I just showed you. This is what they look like. I think they're gorgeous. They're just a simple black heeled... Would you call this Mary Jane style? I may be getting that completely wrong. It has quite a thick heel, which is good, so it has good support, so I can wear them for school rather than a really thin heel. And then it buckles up around the ankle and covers the top of your foot but still cuts out here which I think is a really nice silhouette for a shoe. So I just thought these are really nice. These would look really nice with some cool printed socks which you'd still be able to see having the cutout part here. And I think for the other pair of shoes, frilly socks are adorable with them. So that is my haul. I hope you enjoyed. If there are links to the items that I bought of, bought off of ASOS, they will be below, along with other information, so I recommend checking it out. And if you want me to style any of the pieces that were shown in this video, just let me know down below, and hopefully I will see you in the next video. Bye!